European foreign and defense ministers have held talks on setting up a naval mission in the Mediterranean to target Libyans smuggling people to Europe in life-threatening conditions. Illegal migration jumped to the top of the agenda last month when more than 700 people drowned in the worst shipwreck in decades of dangerous seaborne migration. As part of its migrant strategy, the European Commission last week unveiled a plan to take in 20,000 more refugees over the next two years. The German foreign minister explained, saying, There is no recipe for this and not one single correct response. The most important is that we remain true to our European values and that we conclude our discussion to improve the rescue of those distressed as the European Union ultimately wants to capture smugglers and destroy their boats off the Libyan coast to help tackle the rising number of migrants and potentially stop terrorists from entering EU member states. NATO's chief offered an assessment. There might be foreign fighters, there might be terrorists also trying to hide, to blend in uh, among uh, the migrants. And this just underlines the importance of that we have to respond to this turmoil, to these uh, uh, threats in many different ways. Some 51,000 migrants have entered Europe by crossing the Mediterranean Sea this year, with 30,500 coming via Italy. About 1,800 have drowned in the attempt, according to the UN Refugee Agency.